Welcome, my name is King Isaac 171 and this is my channel. Welcome back everyone to YouTube. Isaac 171, as I literally just said. And my introductory relief video thing and figures that I spent a couple hours creating. And this is YouTube. Oh no. I'm kidding. But no, this is actually the world is called YouTube. Um, it does not mean that it is YouTube, okay? I named this world YouTube so that you guys would know that I'm playing on a world that I'm only playing on once a week, where I make two videos and post them both within a quick time period. Excuse me. So that you guys can have access to them and use them and watch and enjoy and... So, excuse me. I I am tired. I've been busy writing and working on stuff, so I haven't really had time to relax and take a nap. My room, for some odd reason, was uh, 25.5 with a very good temperature. So I opened my window. It has it has not helped much. Gecko for some reason sitting here staring at me like a little villain. I might show you guys this. But he, he, he's staring at me. He's hiding in the tree like, good. Who are these people you talk to, eh? Kind of like my brother who doesn't have a chat with you guys. Isaac! Who are you talking to? And I'm always like, you too. He's like, oh, just talk to Arnie too. I mean, he doesn't always talk back. He doesn't got that sense of that. But, I mean, I can... Get the ball. It's not mine. I can get in trouble. Probably have a hard time getting me in trouble. But, second time. I don't know if they get me in trouble for making videos. I don't think, think of them getting me in trouble for I don't do much, enough stuff that's just wrong. So. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I'm a wee bit tired. Probably should have gone to bed earlier last night and the night before that and the night before that. Definitely the night before that. I'd be a It was not so much fun. Anywho. These guys have to Am I building the hospital yet? Oh, I thought she was just a Hospital is completed. Resources must be close. I need to get the chapel done as well. Bring up my half nurse. I need to get another herbalist done as well. So I bring up my um, heart. I'm a little bit hurtless. I'm actually on loose side today. Yeah. Probably the next person who comes in saying, hey, I got stuff for you to buy up probably. Uh, yeah. Ain't got a for you. How much, what, how much money do I have here? I have 1,500 plus 500, so like 2,000 dollars with that. Efficient. Okay. Uh, how much I have tools, dude? You make me more money. Uh, problem. Five tools now. Nice. Great way to get more tools. Huh? Bill. Darn much. And then that was this. So I can need to get that set up as well. Because you know I need to a lot more than I need this woodcutter. Now. But while we're here, man, I'm gonna try. Right? Man, some stuff is messy. 
Oh, yes, I just remembered. Um, one, me and one of my friends, we've been playing a game for the past little while. It happens to be called... Civilization. Sid Meier's Civilization, actually. We were playing Civ 5 for the past long while. Civ 6 came out recently. Which I don't want to get because I looked at Civ 5 and I'm like, Civ 5 is awesome, Civ 6 is stupid. Oh my days. You see, in Civ 6, you get three workers if you build a worker. And they're even called builders, actually. And they get to build three things. You build one, you lose a build. You build something else, you lose another build. Build the final thing, your builders are all dead. But you have to be built those. I'd rather just get workers and put them on automated and build everything. Like, I've been playing and I was playing on, um, say, a five, and I've probably got about a hundred workers. So, if I lost a hundred workers due to the fact that they couldn't work more than three items, it just make them unscrewed. Meaning in all my cities, instead of building better buildings, I'm going to be building workers so I can build them everywhere. Like, I tend to save up 500 bucks, buy a um, settler, build a city, buy a worker in said city, and send another settler to build another city. And that doesn't look like anything as possible anymore because, well, how they But I will probably make a video, probably make the video of the game because honestly when you're playing online in a huge world, we're playing four corners, okay? So you can fit about, um, I think it's 30 or 40 cities within a corner, like within one of the four corners. And so I have that many in one corner. And I'm building into a second corner now. I've like conquered. I wiped out the inhabitants, which were originally China. And yeah. There's a lot of people there. Or there were a lot of Chinese there, and they're all dead now. But, uh. Yeah, I think I'll stick to sit down. But if you guys want me to get games, like, let me know what the game is. Um, one, I'll check the price. Two, I'll check if my computer can run it. Three, if I, like, I usually won't have the money for games. Like, let's, let's just be honest. There's no reason. I'm saving up for a year, uh, actually, for several years in college and university. And so, I don't have the money really so much just to yodel. If you get what I mean by yodeling, I mean I don't have the money to hang out, have fun, play video games, spend a ton of money on video games. I would like to spend some money, I'd like to buy some new video games and play some high-end ones, buy a better computer, fix my laptops, which but this is awful, this is okay, it's not the best, and my tower computer be like, just get up recently. Hello? Are all those books for me now? Sure, I'll look through them and either they'll go on my shelf or go one of my other places that have some books, so they'll be gone. They'll be back upstairs sitting on the shelves. Oh. Mm. Okay. So yeah, I have like no money right now. <laughs> so that was my uh, dad. I should live at home because it's more cost efficient. If they were only going to charge me 200 bucks a month for room and board, that's a lot cheaper than spending the 10 grand for a year. In most dormitories. So. 
but I love the names of my cities in um, my book. Like, uh, Isildur, and there's Resurgence, and there's Mithril, and there's Apache, and Dragon, and there's Thronosian, and there's the Silver Knights, and there's Baron. Baron is Baron. Yeah. It's fun. <laughs> I really enjoy coming up with names for things that no one else gets but me. Or at least not the reason why I come up with them anyway. It makes it rather efficient for me because everyone's looking at me like, why did you do that? And I'm like, reasons, folks, reasons. And I'm like, I don't get your reasons, okay. I like that. It's fun. But everyone's like, this is stupid. I'm just like, this is great. You guys have no idea what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. Haha. Uh -huh. Yeah. I like that. You don't have to worry about other people knowing what I'm doing when I'm doing it. It's a lot of stone, man. You might just mine that up. Okay. Let us collect all materials from this point quickly. And we'll go straight down, chopping most of that stuff down. Chopping that stuff. Okay, we'll go. Now they will find again all that. Take them a while though, but there will be 17 of them. Yeah, there'll be 17 of them soon enough. Oh, dang it, my food farm! Stop it! No, stop. No one was eating my farms, not my people. And you get the farm stones, so my people have something to eat. It's dangerous when your people ain't got nothing to eat. You might just die. And then you get my tools. Yeah, this is my problem with the games. Some of them I'm doing really good on, other ones I'm like, tools, where'd you go? For instance. I need more herbs, I need more tools. And I have to go. Discipline. I just want to make sure that this is what I want. Yes. Don't want to mop that one. Good to know. Do you guys know said they? No, why? Why haven't they brought the last five logs over here yet? They're something very odd. So that's ready. Okay, so should that guy bring the last five logs over then? This is the last thing that's waiting to be built. Uh, excuse me. At least next to the wire. It's still late on. Hmm. Is he? Is he? It doesn't look like it. Nope. Well, hopefully one of these days they'll put the last five logs on that so it can be prepped and built quickly. I will need to get someone doing that though. I need, I need my tools. Three is not enough. Because I've been going through a lot pretty quickly. Okay. Oh, I'm not going right. This one. Yeah. Yeah. You see, you guys are lucky. Like, for the first 20 years, like after year five, really, there's not near as much to do. At least you're not watching my world, because I would literally do nothing for the next couple hours, and you would just have a recording of me sometimes talking, spinning around in a chair, and being like, "Yay, your 28's done! Yay, your 29's done! Yay, your 30's done!" They take a while. Um, like I would, I generally sit my computer one spot and just fast forward 
10 times, so it's a bit annoying. It's in one spot so it goes faster. And go through a ton of time. Yeah. I think it's fun. So those are ready. Okay, good to know. He's gotta go. Coach. This guy's gonna cancel. Probably, yeah, it's another. Let's switch back to all coats. All coats. Coats. And that should get him working again. <sighs> yeah. So, uh, since I decided to put a uh, hundred of that, hundred wool in there, it's not near as much material as I swear, but... Got a bunch of squash and pumpkins. Do need more foods in that regards, but... I will do fine with some more. Man, this is taking forever to complete. Psych school. You have to sit in class all day. Oh, oh, you don't have to. You can get up and leave sometimes. Depending on the teacher, professor, leave the classroom. But, like, for this, it's like, the chapel. One must build the chapel first. Meaning, therefore, one must have the resources to build the chapel and decide to wait 100 people build in order to have the chapel completed. Not to mention the fact the 210 resources that one must put in there as well, as well as 21 removed. So 210, 230, 3, 380, 381 things have to happen for this chapel in particular to have it built. Yeah. No wonder why it takes a long time, eh? But, okay, let's see. Where's all my food? Okay, that one's 82% full, that one's 34%. Full. So it turns out I've got lots of food. It just takes forever for it to get anywhere. And I've got five tools. Yay, let's build the other tool shack soon. Because that's going to be required, like, now. I need that. And a tool shack. Let's put this guy on and see what I expect him to go to these two. Might not. What else would he go to though? This. This. Oh, he's helping him build that. Okay. So now you guys should get that done in the next two years. <sighs> Reason why I don't like building stuff takes forever. Until you get to the point where you're just like, yeah, I literally have stuff building so that my builder's not bored. Grace has that. I have one builder, right? And I literally have a bunch of houses for him to build because there's literally nothing else for him to do. Literally. Nothing. Nothing else. Public transit costs me like half as much a year. Uh, a little bit more than, a little bit less than half as much you don't pay for insurance for your vehicle. But I'm just saying, you know, right? I would do that, but when I sit here and think about it, I realize just how bad of an idea that is. You see, if I took public transit, I can't stand the smell of cigarettes when on. When I'm on or off a bus, like, taking public transit would have more smell of cigarettes on it. That's just a bad idea. Okay, yeah, where am I? It's there. Busy leaving the purpose. Getting something lean. Way to go. You're gonna die. Oh, days. I need to get more herbs. I need a lot more herbs. Oh right, I forgot about that herbalist. I forgot the middle of that. Okay. I need the herbalist and the tool thing being done now. As well as a new herd thing, so that the chickens don't all die. 
small pendant enclosure over here. I have six stone. Wait. Looks like five in there. Something like that. I really enjoy the aspect of like building in a giant country. So like if I'm playing, say if I like not attacking or by I just smack people on defense, so I defend and just destroy the defense. By like just building that overpowered defensive wall that nothing makes through and you're just like, yep, no big deal. No biggie. Just because the massive empire. Like I was actually playing a game that's all it's all war based. And so a lot of people attack you. And I destroy like everyone. Or everyone who attacked me kind of died. But um so I was playing there was a guy beside me, okay, and I was taking everything in my immediate area. And he decided to build or capture a castle, okay. It was a free castle is what they're called. Basically they're castles that were owned by AIs and he captured the castle and okay, I don't care. And the guy coincidentally did not rename the castle, so it said free castle. And I recently reached the number of funds I required for the castle. And so I sent I was about to send my army there. But then I saw the person's name. I was like, oh, well. So I sent the guy a message and I sent the alliance he was part of the message and said that, hey, this guy has a castle called Free Castle. Named Free Castle. And I was about to invade it and absolutely annihilate whatever forces he had in there because I thought it was a Free Castle. And so I figured I'd let them know and I let them know they contacted him, they contacted me and said, okay, we'll deal with it. I said, thanks. And I sent the message the next day and said that if he doesn't have a down ch name change within three days, I will most likely be attacking it and destroying it. And they said, okay. So he had a change the next day because I think he realized that uh, he had three castles. Okay, he had uh, maxed out. I think it's 148. A couple other ones, and I was in there with uh, much higher level building. I was much higher up in the world. He was. As I had four matched castles in the area. I think it was just four. Might have been more. So I had at least four matched castles in the area. And. We'll see what's the match. And I was just like. So I thought it was funny because it's like it's one guy sitting there with this this these forces. He's a uh, no. I had five. I had, I basically built as many castles as I could in that area from free castles I captured, or people in my clan that 
or like proof that left and whatnot. But so like I I thought it was hilarious because the guy actually had I thought that I actually would have attacked him, I actually would have been at that base. And if I had it my way, I could have gone and took the rest of his bases. That would have been too much, so I didn't. Man. Not fun being sick. Do you honestly understand me get there? Never my things. Sometimes creatures start you in the weirdest ways, like how can you lie lying right now? It's a little bit off. But anywho. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And um, if you want to comment in the video, comment if you liked it or disliked it, or if you want someone else to comment, or just say hi, I guess, even in the comments if you want. Do that. Maybe I'll respond, maybe I won't. I might just chat about it in one of my videos when the end of that comes around. I'm gonna save for the next one. So, um, once after this video comes out, I'm going to end the competition that I'm doing, where it is guessing my what education I have and my age. So you can guess education level and the age, you know, when all is said and done. If you get it right. Anyway, and don't really have a prize for you, but hey. Alright. Anywho, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.